Hi friends, welcome to testing to reverse point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about how to set up a realist performance test using passing in JMeter. See, uh, this is a realistic performance test means there is a thing timing. It's a simulating action user with timing and delays means actual users how they're acting now so many times we are trying for a single user while using thread and we are doing rotation right the count we are increasing and it will happen continuously it will provide the data but we can see the time and delays and all right to using that passing is there it is controlling the ramp up and down of the virtual users and what exactly the ramp up it is presented and uh, none of the virtual users how they acting for uh, hitting for that particular api or ui whatever maybe it's a ramp up they are going to controlling using passing and control the time between the iteration each iteration the controlling the timing achieving the exit ration in a y minutes and seconds means Whenever they hitting that user, how many iterations, how many minutes and all we can able to control using this passing. To do that, we have to add for stepping thread group. To, that is a plugin. And after that, we need to do for set up some required settings. Then we need to run it. And here, when you come to the options, there is a main plugin managers. You have to open then available here you have to search that plugin and you need to do it and i already installed here you can able to come here like in the down there is a jpg standard set this is called a stepping one okay you have to add this plugin once you add the plugin then you can able to utilize this plugin okay and for adding the uh, plugin manager i done for one video and it is available into my playlist and you can go through that one more time how to add this plugin manager in case if you don't have and if you don't know how to add the plugin manager you can go through that you can able to get it okay and once you come to here right click add thread groups and you can able to see there is a stepping thread group and previous what we done we are going to come and we are just adding for thread group now here we are going to add for stepping thread group okay once you added the stepping thread group you can able to see there is a flow chart and the values we are what we are providing okay here you can able to provide first time how many requests we need to do 10 or 20 or 5 whatever it may be <coughs> the seconds it will wait okay then if you want to start 10 you can able to use 10 okay next how many add we need to thread in the thread we need to how many we need to add and each thread how many uh, how many seconds it need to be do 10 and seconds wrap up time how how many you can able to mention zero and 60 seconds means we need to wait the whole that for load for 60 seconds okay finally stop we can able to mention and we can able to mention here also 10 then it is looked like this one and if you specify here 10 you can able to see the proper <coughs> whenever i change the finally stop also this based upon that this graph is changing and if you waiting sir values are changing the wrap up time is changing then based upon that also it will change according to these values and this is called a threading we can able to say like 
here ramp up and virtual users and time between the iteration each timing iteration we can able to see here see basically here what will happen the users are it is waiting for 10 places and it is increasing okay then again 10 start means first 10 it is start then after 10 it will wait whenever we hit up to 10 seconds it will wait then after that it will start for 10 threads means in 100 place 10 threads are start then again it will next it will add and up to 10 place then again it will start for remaining 20 means 10 it will add then thread every time is 10 seconds and it will hold means every time we are going to add for 10 10 10 10 10 10 okay once you added here and once you stopped here then it will hold for 60 seconds okay means one minute it will wait the ramp up okay then once it is added and here every thread it will stop here now final stop i added for 10 you can able to here you can able to see here one minute 60 seconds it will wait and finally stop also it will do for 10 10 10 10 10 and it will stop for each time for 10 seconds okay for to check this one we can able to add for one sampler http request and also i'm going to add for one listener view tree and i'm going to add for one more listener aggregation report okay and these two i'm going to add and here a simple request i'm going to adding for this one this is a free endpoint and i'm going to use this one now my report and everything is ready now you can see here okay and here it will change the value whenever i hit it okay it will be 10 seconds now you can see here the count is started but still we are not getting for report correct now 10 after 10 it is started for 10 hitting correct it will keep on hitting for that after 10 minutes again 20 it is increased 20 now 30 once it is coming 30 then again you can able to see 10 in increments means we tried 100 and each time we are increasing our value and delay also we can able to see the 10 seconds delay then only the value is increasing correct and aggregation report also you can able to see there is keep on it will increase the new values and we can able to see how many hittings and all we can able to see here okay and after completion of one iteration and it will keep on stopping that all the endpoints means it will keep on doing stopping that request we can able to see the best of and it will keep on increasing and decreasing that values and all this way we can able to achieve this x iteration in a y minutes and seconds we can able to achieve and also time between iterations also we can able to control ramp up and down of the overall users we can able to control using this pass okay this simple plugin we can able to do and we can able to do for And now we done for run and validation also we done okay that's all about this video how and if you like please like subscribe to my youtube channel don't forget to share with your friends and colleagues